Hello everyone, Arctic Fox Airsoft Tay here, and today we got another gas mask. Uh, this gas mask that we're going to be reviewing today is one I'm very excited about. I've been wanting it for a long time, and it's also very rare and sought after. This is the XM28 Grasshopper. Now, the XM28 Grasshopper was, uh, is a cheap filter mask, as you can see by here. There's no external filters. Um, just like the M17, when the, um, America was going through the cheap filter, uh, time period. So, uh, it's made of silicone, um, and it has exhale valve here, and then two internally, internal filters here, some plastic lenses here, so it won't be stopping any airsoft. But, um, the thing that makes this so rare is that it's an experimental, so, Back in the 50s, uh, they had the M9 gas mask, which is a really good gas mask. Then they were dumb, and they decided to use the M17. The Americans did. So the M17 is also a cheap filter mask. It also has eyes like uh, triangle eyes like this, but it is not as low profile. It's big, it's bulky, and it's uncomfortable. It's just an all-around bad mask. So uh, they also had this experimental model. Um, it they made it a few thousand of these, I believe, um, and it, a couple of them were used by, uh, riot agencies to, um, for riot control situations. Um, so the gas mask cost me 40 bucks, uh, usually around, cost uh, around 100, 120 dollars, so that's a rough estimate. So, uh, I'm gonna put this on. Okay guys, hold on. Okay guys, so this is the XM28 grass hopper. I don't know if you can hear me because there's no voice diaphragm, which is a, um, not good. So you can't really hear me that well. So, uh, this is a very comfortable mask. It's a lot more comfortable than, let's say, the Porsche, the Porsche MC1, which is my other guy, another guy. I also have an M40, which the uh, link will be up in the top right, I believe. So, I really like how this looks. It looks very cool. It uh, definitely looks like the Grasshopper. Like, uh, and this is one of the things I really like about Vietnam Experimental. Because they experimented with a lot of equipment during Vietnam to best up the Viet Cong and best up the Soviets more. So, uh... This gas mask is very good, but it is a cheap filter mask, so it comes with all the flaws. It's also very light, and I think it's about 0.4 kilos. So yeah, that's going to wrap up our review, and be sure to leave a like and subscribe.